So I just watched the first episode of She-Hulk for some reason. I just thought I'd give my thoughts on it because my brain has consumed so much secondhand cringe that I need to chug fucking jet fuel and jerk off to RuPaul's Drag Race. Yeah. So like the first episode just flat out pisses me off. Like all of the characters in the show who weren't leads were just shallow stereotypes. And it makes me want to give out family sized bags of chips to a bunch of kids at an orphanage and then laugh at them because they have the chips but not the family. But seriously, like her lawyer cunt work colleague was just this like toxic male character, but that's all he was. Like literally in the first fucking scene, she's reading her statement thingy and he hears this awesome like closing argument thing and his first instinct is to just be like, Oh, it's wordy, you should just let me do your job because penis dick ball man, dick and balls, penis toxic man. Bro just heard great shit and then gave no feedback except, I need to do this because I'm a man. Like, if you work with this motherfucker, why would you even ask him for feedback if he's just gonna be like, You no good, I better... <laughs> what the fuck? You also see him, like, later in the show in a bar and he refers to a woman as it. There's a hot chick over there, I'm gonna go talk to it. Huh? Just a stupid fucking stereotype, man. And look, if you want to add a toxic male character into your show, then great. But then do it well. Don't worry, he's not the only guy in the show. Uh, there's three other guys who walk up to her when she's alone outside of a fucking bar and are going like, Uh, me and my friends want to fuck you. <laughs> and obviously situations like that could happen. I'm not saying it, it could never, but like right outside of a bar full of people, I, I don't think so. My main point for bringing like this kind of thing up is just it wasn't written well and it didn't add anything to the show besides look at these shitty men that this green Mike and Ike motherfucker lady She-Hulk has to deal with. But it's not just the men that were shitty stereotypes, it's also the women. Talk about equality, am I right? <laughs> Like, she's in the bar bathroom, right, all dirty and shit from running and probably, I don't know, eating shit in the fucking woods, whatever the fuck she was doing. Just, like, lo looking musty as fuck. And, and then a bunch of girls come in and then just start putting makeup over the fucking dirt on her face. So either all these people in the show that we've seen so far are just fucking brain dead, or the director is. Because fucking hell. My absolute favorite part of the show was when the Hulk clapped and sent her fucking flying with the like the sonic wave he created and then she clapped with like much less effort and completely like destroyed him back I don't know bro it just made me think I see those hands clapping but what about the cheeks <laughs> A fucking boom, boom, boom. Hulk smash. <laughs> fucking, they're just like they're crumbling cities and you're just fucking roaring. Just, <laughs> you just you just hear like a fucking roar in the distance and the sonic waves just get bigger and fucking bigger with this with this loud fucking boom. <laughs> That's how she really got her powers. It wasn't from their blood mixing. It was from their genitals mixing. <laughs> Breaking news! The tectonic plates have shifted tremendously in the span of just five minutes today after a series of earthquakes hit the northern hemisphere and seemed to get more and more intense, reaching a brutal climax and then coming to an abrupt stop. This just in. The earthquakes seem to not be the only thing erupting. <laughs> We've just received shocking CCTV footage of the Hulk viciously plowing. We've just received shocking CCTV footage of the Hulk viciously plowing his fucking cousin. Smash. <laughs> oh. Sorry. Every time I see the goddamn clip of her clapping her hands, I just start laughing. Like, I gotta find it. I gotta fucking find this shit. <laughs> <laughs> He's like grunting in pain. <laughs> Hulk comes. <laughs> yeah, don't Google Hulk sex. It's an actual part of Google that I wish I never saw. Nah, but anyways, the show isn't as disappointing as I thought it was going to be. Like, the acting was a lot better than I expected. It was mainly just the, the writing and the CGI that was, like, questionable. Now, of course, I haven't seen the whole show. I don't even know if I'm going to at this point. I'm not really excited for it, so... 
probably won't even watch it. Phase 4 has been real hit or miss, mostly miss. And I mean, it's kind of obvious why it's mostly miss. Like, I'm not fucking surprised, right? Like, they're, they're mass producing this shit for the money. What, you think they're gonna spend time on this shit and actually make something that's, like, quality? They've already done that. <laughs> now they just want to milk the fuck out of this franchise and then, yeah. It's definitely a quantity over quality kind of thing, which is kind of funny because that's just kind of how content is now. You know, even with, with videos that I do, it's like, what can I put out the most or how, how many, you know, how can I set up ways to record more as opposed to more quality. And don't get me wrong, the new Spider-Man was really good, and I'm actually excited for the new Black Panther. That looks like it's gonna be really good too, uh, but that's because they actually spent time working on those, you know, making sure it's up to the same standard that the older stuff was. But yeah, those are my thoughts. I guess you could say this show was an abomination. <laughs> wow, that was hilarious. Thank you. Yeah, I don't know who the fuck greenlit this show. Ah! Ah, it's just like your stepdad, because they keep coming. Alright, well I hope you guys enjoyed me rambling on about a superhero show that was made for mainly kids and grown men living in their mom's basement. If you enjoyed this video, let me know. You know, this kind of video is easy to make, it's easy to edit, and it's fun. So if it was entertaining or boring, just let me know in the comments, you know, let me know if you want to see more. Yeah, always, always down to make some videos for you guys. <laughs> if you could like the video, by the way, I'll suck your cup. Thanks for watching. Catch you later.